dump three is kind of the thing that uh, you're just at the dirt jumps with your buddies and you're spinning threes, spinning threes, do a bunch of normal threes and all of a sudden you get inspired and you just crack into a big dumped one and everybody will be like, whoa, and you'll, that's how you know you did a good one. Everybody's going, what was that? <laughs> Uh, we're out here filming for New World Disorder 10, my fifth time filming for New World Disorder. And uh, one of the moves you've seen me doing in all those years is like a good dump three. So I'm here to tell you today how to do it, run you through the steps that I uh, figured out on how to get the nose nice and low and cork one out nice and flat and dump for you. Step one, know how to do a 360 already. Step two, you want to take a little bit more speed into it than you would just a regular 360. Step three, lean back off the lip because you're going to pop off the back wheel almost like a back flip. Step four, as soon as your front tire leaves the lip, drop your shoulder and look underneath your arms. So if you can come off the lip and start to see the landing, you throw your head down, throw your shoulders down and watch the back of it the whole time. When you get upside down enough, you're actually looking underneath your whole bike at the back side of the landing until you come around. Step five, keep the arms out like this, extend it as much as you can spot that landing and, and ride away smoothly and then get lots of high fives from your homies. Five steps. It took me five New World Sword movies to figure out those five steps. And you get it in a five minute web video. Ah. <laughs> so once you get upside down enough, you feel that little bubble in your brain go upside down. You're like, I'm upside down, but I'm just doing 360. It's the craziest thing ever. Then you want to go up and do it again. And usually you have to get your, uh, build your special power up first before you can get into a good dumper. <laughs> 